Hey guys, before the video begins, I want you to guys make sure you guys like and subscribe, comment, and if you subscribe, I get a notification of your name, and I will shout you out in the next video. So make sure you guys like and subscribe. Portal and Half-Life share a universe. I believe this is true because in Portal Still Alive, GLaDOS mentions how Black Mesa could help you, and she laughs about it. In Half-Life 2, Episode 2, the Aperture Science Borealis is seen. It needs a little bit longer. If you're waiting for the Combines, go ahead. They'll soon... So this could possibly relate to one another. Chell is Cave Johnson's daughter. This has been a fear among Portal players for quite a while since the release of Portal 2. I do not think this is true just because it wouldn't really make sense for this coincidence to happen. But if you think it's true, leave a suggestion down below. Greek mythology has been set around in Portal, from the turret to other characters. I think Portal was based off of Greek mythology, at least some of it. What do you guys think? F-stop. I did make a video about this, but I took it down a little while ago. It's where a player would use a camera in a Portal 2, which is would be the beta. It would take pictures and it would like redraw the sizes of it. Companion Cube has dead bodies. Lados mentions how sentient the Companion Cubes might be. Rather, it's not to talk to it, not to interact with it, or really just not anything with it besides using it. Wheatley is the intelligence core. In Portal 1, we see the intelligence core has a blue eye and an aperture logo right above it. Wheatley has the same thing, but I don't believe that because Wheatley in the intelligence core has different accents. Who be the hoop? At the end of Portal, you can see a hoop fall. The developers wanted this to become a meme. They even named it Hoopty the Hoop. In Portal 2, there are references of it scattered around the map. Portal Stories Mel. Portal Stories Mel is a fan-made Portal game. It includes, at the end, Chell waking up, which people think it might be related to Portal, but I just think it isn't. Human body preparation recipe. The intelligence core says stuff about it. I'm not gonna get into too deep, but this is what people think the cake is made out of. Ratman in the turret choir. At a split session, you can see someone jumping around the turret. People think this is Ratman, but I think it's the Wheatley made turret cubes because it has a box and it jumps. So people speculate it's Ratman, but I don't think it is. Portal is psychological. Portal is psychological because Chell um, gets the companion cube and, and GLaDOS makes the companion cube burn, which might be a psychological test. GLaDOS with arms. An early test of GLaDOS for Portal 2 was seen with arms. People thought this is disturbing, but I think it was pretty cool. Male protagonist. In the 2006 Portal trailer, once you go through the portal, there can be seen a male, which was later changed to Ch Chell clones. The portal in the Flash version, multiple Chells can be seen. People think that GLaDOS has been using these just in case Chell dies, but I'm not sure. Peabody found in the itch. On one of the tests in the chapter eight itch, Peabody can be seen running out of a door and running back in. I think this was just an Easter egg and nothing to like out of the ordinary. Narbacli or drop. This was a game before Portal, which Valve took it as an inspiration and hired the team that made Norvacure drop. It uses portals and Valve really liked the concept. Head crab in elevator shaft. In Portal 2, this image has been flying around of a head crab in the elevator shaft. I think this was added in because all the times I've played Portal, I have never seen this. Aperture.com I can't get much information about this because the website is now taken down. People say the coded messages in one of Ratman's um, dens shows a code that you put into Aperture.com and it shows up some things. I can't get any footage of this because like I said, it no longer exists, but I think it was just a, a promotion for Portal or Portal 2. Everything is sentient. Everything is sentient is a theory among players. Because the companion cubes allegedly have dead bodies. I just covered this pretty recently. And 
the wall panels are censored and they have movements. So this is why people believe everything is sentient. You know these